and I don't know what to do anymore. I have no idea. Hey Mountain Family, how's it going? I'm just not having a very good mental health day. I don't even know what the plan is for today. I don't know what I'm vlogging today. I don't know what I'm doing. Um, I'm still feeling very triggered and upset, uh, reliving what I relived last night. I haven't really talked uh, very much in depth about that part of the story in a while for a reason. <laughs> And reliving it last night, just, uh, sorry. I'm still, like, dealing with it. And then, just to, like, rub salt in the wound, uh, I've lost, like, 17 subscribers today. And I don't understand. I don't, I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> I make a video supporting the mental health community, and I suffer for it. But he gets to make a video joking about it and get support. <laughs> oh, I'm so mad I can't handle it. Um, <laughs> like what is wrong with the world? Um, so that's basically how I'm feeling today. I'm just very um, confused and I don't know what to do anymore. I have no idea. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing to continuously talking about mental health. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing supporting that community anymore. Uh, I, I just don't know. I don't know. Because it is a um, stigmatized topic. And if there are so many people who think that it's perfectly okay, and if that outweighs the people who are like, no, this is not okay, then what am I doing? <sighs> Maybe it's just not something I should talk about anymore. But I feel like I'm letting down those who look forward to those vlogs and who um, like those vlogs because it helps them. I'm sorry that I can't be happy, go lucky, my life is perfect, everything's great. I'm sorry I can't be that way today. I'm sorry I can't just put on a fake face and be perfect for you guys. I'm sorry that I show my real emotions, my real feelings, my real life. I'm, I'm I mean... <laughs> I don't even know why I'm apologizing for it. I feel like I need to really step back and think about what I'm gonna do because I don't know what I'm gonna do. They say all the time that if you're a sensitive person then you shouldn't do YouTube because people out there are judgy and mean and don't give a crap and you hear that a lot. Like I, part of the um, uh, YouTube groups that I'm part of on Facebook, uh, they say that a lot. Like, if you're sensitive, be careful on YouTube because you're gonna get some crap. But that's like who I am. That's also who I am. I'm a very sensitive person. I have been my whole life. I, I don't watch the news. This is how sensitive I am. I can't watch the news. Like, I can't just sit down and turn on the news and just watch it for a while. Like, I can't do that because I get very overwhelmed at how bad the world's getting and it just scares me. I can't do it. And having to um, witness everything that's going on right now kind of like put me in a place that I don't like to be. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's important for people to see how all of this has affected somebody. Maybe it is important to show that. I don't know. Is it? I really, really, really admire Brittany from Brittany and Baby, but she said something that has just stuck with me. It's been in like the back of my mind. She said something along the lines because I can't remember the exact words and I can't even remember the vlog. I, I just can't remember um, where I saw that she said this. I just know that she said it. She said that she goes to YouTube to escape and to forget about, you know, what's bothering her, etc. And I feel like a lot of people do that. And when you watch my channel, you get a lot of reality, you get a lot of me, you get a lot of raw emotion. Maybe people are put off by that. Am I supposed to apologize for who I am? I don't know. I don't know what this vlog is going to look like. I don't know how the rest of this day is going to go. But I'm going to just keep going anyway. Hi. Oh, you found Kenley's trolls? Yeah! Those Kenley's trolls? 
It's amazing how much bigger the living room feels now that the Christmas tree is gone. You want some lunch? Yeah. Lunch? What? I know it's your trolls. Can Sissy play with it? <laughs> oh, that's nice. You want some lunch? Yeah. And All right. what? Yes, we're going to have lunch. My kitchen is kind of a mess. Just a little bit. But it's the only room in the house that really does need some cleaning up. It's, you know, dishes mostly and just wiping down the counter. That's about it. I wish we had more storage in this house so I wouldn't have to resort to using my counter. But it is what it is. It's almost payday. Two paydays in two days. So we're having peanut butter sandwiches and some goldfish. I might have a peanut butter sandwich myself. Don't question it. The truth will break your chains, we have the key Open your eyes and see We are the ones who know the answers And they ain't never gonna hold us back The sea is rising like it dances so while I'm sitting here waiting for my pizza rolls to cook, because that's what I decided on, I thought I would ask your guys, like, opinion. I went live on Facebook for New Year's Eve because Devin was working. I had nobody keep me company except the girls, but the girls needed to go to sleep. And I was um, asked if I would go live more often. So I'm going to ask you guys, like, how often do you want me to go live? Uh, when? <laughs> would you all watch? Um, I'd probably go live on Facebook more often often than any other social media. I mean, Instagram, let's be honest. You can really only go live on like Facebook and Instagram. I don't think you can do that on Twitter yet, can you? But anyway, it would be on Facebook. Devin has to work this Saturday, so I thought, why not go live this Saturday? Let me know in the comments what you think, and I will let you guys know I'll do an announcement vlog so you all will know when I go live. Listen. Kinley's crying? Yeah. Oh my god. What's wrong? What's wrong? Oh my gosh. Poor Kinley. We don't know how it happened because she won't tell me. But she cut off or scraped off or something. The top layer of her um, finger right there is bleeding pretty bad. We don't have any band-aids because somebody has an obsession with sticky stuff and then putting it near her mouth. So somebody got into all the band-aids and decided to use them all up. So I had to improvise. I had to take a little bit of um, wipey and I cut it up really small so it's not going to be as wet as this is. It's this like little tiny itty bitty piece. It's not that wet. And I had to cut up a sticker, a belly sticker that we didn't get to use. And I cut it up into like this kind of a piece and I had to just wrap her finger with a tiny piece of um, baby wipe and the sticker. I had to make a makeshift band-aid. <laughs> I had to improvise and you feel so much better now. Yeah. Everything's okay. <laughs> let's go outside, Miss Ellie. Yes, let's go outside. Oh my gosh, I can't handle the cold. I can't handle the snow. I was not meant for the snow. Hi, baby girl. Hi. Oh, uh, yeah. She doesn't know what to do with the snow either. I'm trying to lick it. <laughs> Looking at <laughs> such a good girl, yes. Oh, Miss Ellie. If only I can get you potty, potty trained. trained. It's taking forever. Don't know why. I take you outside. Huh? You should you take you outside. You're such a good girl. Other than that, uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> Already then. <laughs> oh, what's wrong? What is it? Please don't crawl in the cage. Please don't crawl in the cage. Oh, thank God. You just want your mommy? Just wanted her mommy. That's all I wanted. I don't know why she doesn't hold me 24 7. I don't understand. I know. What's my problem? Really? 
You know what? Today has been so craptastic. I think I'm going to eat my feelings just a tiny bit. Devin has been wanting me to make cookies anyway, so I think I'm going to make some for him and just have a couple just to make myself feel a tiny bit better. I don't start my diet until I can grocery shop this Friday, so while I have two days to eat some cookies, why not? Look at those cookies. Yeah. Yum. And I think this is where I'm going to leave you guys. I have a very cranky two-year-old. She is not feeling good. She's been cranky and upset ever since she hurt her finger. I have to clean this kitchen, wipe down this counter, edit this video. <laughs> yeah, my evening is just packed. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to follow me on social media, there are links down below as well as a link to my other channel and I'll see you guys later in a new vlog. Bye guys. Bye.